Hi, Wan No Hidaya. We are from Group 3 Management of Technology. Today, my team will bring a presentation to you. What is our topic? We are going to present about drone. So now, let's we proceed to objectives. We got three objectives, which are learn the importance of technology drone, able to understand use of drone, and allowed to understand benefits and disadvantages of drone. So, what is drone? Here we can see a photo of drone at our left side. And drone is actually an unmanned aircraft. They are more formally known as unmanned aerial vehicles, which are pronounced as UAV or unmanned aircraft systems. There are also a flying robots that can be remotely controlled or flying autonomously using software control. So, why drone invented? Why drone invented? A uh, drone originally built for military purpose. Then the drone also used in a range of civilian roles, including search and rescue surveillance. But now, drone also using for agriculture too. Next. Now, let's rewatch a video of drones. Drones are revolutionizing the military, emergency services, aerospace, and potentially even the taxi industry. The growth of these unmanned aerial craft presents new opportunities for the aerospace industry. But with more and more of them popping up, are they safe to crowd our skies? I'm here at the Dubai Air Show where several of the latest drones are on display. This here is the Aura 100 UAV. UAV stands for Unmanned Aerial Vehicle. The company behind this drone are in the UAE to promote its capabilities and find customers. We have already finalized all the test flights and we have uh, a few samples which are actually uh, ready and flying. I can say that we are ready for production now. But the Aura 100 faces stiff competition with drones from all over the world on display here in Dubai. We've been flooded with opportunities here uh, from the defense sector and the government sector to oil and gas. Uh, the response has been really good. Jason Braverman is here with his Canadian built drone, which he says is ideal for monitoring pipelines and carrying out surveillance. If you look at the world, this is really the center of oil and gas, and this region has very particular security issues. The drone industry is expected to be worth $100 billion globally by 2020, with military applications making up the bulk of the market at $70 billion. Consumer drones are expected to hit $17 billion, while businesses and civil governments make up the last $13 billion. Drone use is expected to grow in all of these three segments as production costs decrease and the technology behind drones advances. For consumers, this could mean heading to a park and flying a miniature drone with a camera for that perfect photo. Commercial drones are used in sectors like transport, agriculture, construction or disaster relief. In the aviation industry, for example, planes can now be inspected for safety by using cameras mounted on drones. And in the military, the application of drones has allowed armed forces to spy, increase their situational awareness, gain tactical advantages on the battlefield and even shoot at targets. Controlling a drone of this type can be done in one of two ways. Most are remote controlled, but some can self-fly using onboard flight sensors and navigation systems like GPS to follow digital flight plans. Amazon is developing Prime Air for autonomous pilotless deliveries, while Project Wing is Alphabet's version of the technology. In 2019, DHL partnered with Chinese UAV maker Ehang to create a customized route for deliveries. Ehang's new drone, the Falcon, was specifically designed to overcome complicated road conditions and congestion. US drone startup Natalis wants to take unmanned delivery even further. It recently completed tests for an unmanned aircraft prototype that can carry cargo long distance over the sea. There's only two ways to ship goods. It's of course by ocean freight, which is very slow, but inexpensive and of course air freight. And we were always wondering if there was a solution that is something in the middle. The plan is to reduce air freight costs by inventing a futuristic cargo drone that would be 17 times faster than a cargo ship, but half the price of using a Boeing 747. The prototype is 30 feet in wingspan and weighs about 2,200 pounds. The first product is a 3.4 metric ton freighter meant for feeder operation and express service delivery with companies such as FedEx and UPS and other worldwide ones. And uh, first flight is scheduled in two years. 
Frankfurt Airport and drone maker Volocopter are exploring the potential for an electric air taxi service that doesn't require a pilot. The same vehicle was already used to fly above Singapore's Marina Bay in October this year. That trip was piloted, but the aim is full autonomy. Airbus and Boeing also have their own flying taxi projects that would eventually dispense with an onboard pilot. Autonomous urban aircraft could become a $1.5 trillion industry by 2040. That includes everything from delivery drones, flying taxis, military unmanned aerial vehicles and industrial worker drones. Analysts don't see technology as a barrier, noting that battery capacity, computing power and the rise of 5G technology are all rapidly converging. But if tech isn't the issue, then what will stop drones crowding the skies? What can stop them crashing into each other and tumbling to the ground? This is a UAV traffic management system. What this technology does is identify drones in the sky, helping to avoid collisions with other aircraft such as planes, helicopters or other drones. Our goal is to help every drone that's flying broadcast their position so that another aviator can receive that information and make a decision. In the future, the technology will be clever enough where drones can talk to drones, drones can talk to airplanes automatically and they can automatically avoid. The system has been designed to work in tandem with a camera mounted on a radar which can spot drones heading towards a restricted area. So the cameras can integrate it with that drone radar to follow this thing as it's being picked up. Is it a bird? Is it a plane? What is it? Okay, it's a drone. Great. Now, is it a drone we know about or is it a rogue element that we need to take a different action on? By one estimate, there will be more than 76,000 drones operating in the UK skies by 2030. The majority will be deployed for defence, health and education in the public realm and agriculture, mining and energy firms in the private sector. But as with other disruptive technologies, public policy often has to play catch up. Safety remains the main concern of regulators. Analysts say that current US Federal Aviation Authority restrictions have been an obstacle to the sector's commercial development. They argue in order to unlock the technology's potential, drones should be allowed to fly above 400 feet, be allowed to fly out of the pilot's line of sight and be granted the ability to self-pilot and soar over populated areas. Drones have been with us for several years now and their growth looks set to soar. Benefits should include an increase in productivity and safety and even new jobs to the drone economy. But how they fly, where they fly, and what they're being used for are all problems to be solved. Thanks for watching. Let us know in the comments below which industry you think is going to benefit most from the rise of the drones. In this video, there's already mentioned three important points. The first is drone is getting famous in market. And the second point is drone can be convenient in delivery. And the last point is the way to prevent drone accident. Nowadays, we can see the drone in any way, for example, in canvas, sport event, vlog, and also the playground outside your home. Based on the chart show in the video, the drone industry is expected to be worth 100 billion globally by 2020. The military field will be the main contributor for the drone market with military application that making up the group of market at 70 billion. Next, consumer drone are expected to hit 17 billion and the last 13 billion will make up by business and civil government field. Drone can become more popular in consumer because drone process the ability to to reach the most remote area without a, a pilot. This ability make a simple solution for the majority of daily needs. And the next point, drone can be convenient in delivery. Because it can fly autonomous mostly when they are equipped with on board flight sensor and navigation system such as GPS. The drone can avoid complicated route condition and congestion and make the delivery process become more efficient. Amazon and some other countries are developing pilotless deliveries to reduce flight contract during pandemic COVID-19. In 2019, DHL partnered with Chinese UAV maker Ehang to create a customizer route of the various. Besides that, in US, the drone company Nautilus is looking for a solution that can overcome the expensive of air freight and the slowly of the sea freight. <coughs> they are planning to inventing a futuristic cargo drone that will be 17 times faster than a cargo ship but half the price of using Boeing 747. Therefore, drone will be the main delivery to ocean. And last, the way to prevent drone accident. The New Zealand's air navigation service provider, Airways, has been invention the UAV traffic management system, which can identify drone in the sky and helping to avoid 
collision with other aircraft. Next. So how drone operator? Drone can fly because of propellers. Propeller provide aerodynamic force to drone and make it fly in the air. The propeller must rotate in different directions to generate the lift and maintain the drone in the air. In each pair of propellers, one is rot rotating clockwise and others one is rotating counterclockwise. As they rotate, they are correct a zone of low pressure. Air move moves from low pressure regions to high pressure pressure regions. That's how the drone is able to move up, down, forward, and backward, depending on how the speed at which the propeller rotate. Next, drone can fly autonomously when it is equipped with an on board flight sensor and navigation system. Navigation system is the main technology that makes drone can fly autonomously. The navigation system is responsible for providing vector information such as the position, speed, and flight attitudes of the reference, reference co coordinated system to the drone and guide, guiding the drone to, to fly according the, of the, to the specified route. There are three benefits of drones. First is military use, second is delivery use, and third one is op rescue operation. For military use, Military also use, make use of drones in the army squad. For example, as right, um, army invented or modified their own drones just for military purpose. It is called UAV, unmanned aerial vehicles. These drones are equipped with bombs and missiles. The purpose of drones is to avoid soldiers to risking their own life. Secondary, military also use drone technology to spy their enemy. This is because drones are equipped with night vision or thermal sensors so that army can spy for their enemy in certain location. This is because drones are high up in the sky, so enemy won't easy to detect if there is anyone spying on them. Second, delivery use. Drones are powerful technology, not only in just taking photo of camera using drones. Drones also can carry things that are heavier than their own weight. Delivery service like food delivery, parcel delivery, and letter delivery can be done by using drone technology. The benefits of using drones for this business are they can cut cut down their costs and make their delivery more systematic and efficient. And the last one is rescue operation. As explained in the last point, drones can make delivery easier. With the same ability, drones can help in rescue operation when the situation demanded. Rescue operation requires us to arrive at the scene quickly. Any delay will cause to serious matter. For example, drones can help to detect lost people in the dark with their night vision, night vision and thermal sensor. Besides that, drones also can help to locate lost hikers in the mountain to provide information to the department that are responsibility to send help except to them. Next. The disadvantage of the drone go three. First is limited distance. Second is cost injury and third is expensive. First, limited as distance, the battery of life of the drone is not long as you think. Because the battery is small, so the flying distance of the drone is of waste of waste of wisely limited and it needs to realize on changing of to maintain the power. Outer 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 drone battery are getting better and be better with the advancement on the time. Ordinary drone can still only fly with within a distance of about six kilometers from the remote control. Otherwise, they will lose control of the drone. So we will not see any drone that can deliver package over any long distance for the long time. Second, cost injury. There is not that then the drone proper uh, preparer spinning at a high speed can cause injury. The preparer of the drone is like a sharp knife. It may not cut your finger at a high speed, but it can easily cut through the soft part of our body. As we become more exper experienced with a drone flying, we will get close in flight, which is like likely to cause irreparable damage to us. Until today, there, will, there have many incidents of drone causing harm to people, such as an English uh, kid lose an ice in 2015 after a drone 
the drone, a drone preparer read on his eyes after the operator lost control of the drone. Another another inside incident about drone injuring is in 2016, two winning attendees in Coren, La, Coren, Corolina filing a lawsuit against the waiting's host. Alleging physical in and metal inject. The drone collin, coll collected uh, with, the, with them during the reception. Allegedly injuring them physical, uh, physically and emotionally. So we should keep a safe distance for the drone when using it. And always check if there are people around the drone. Avoid coming there. The third is expensive. Num numerous pastimes do not require a significant, significant financing investment. Buying a used DSLR camera if you want to get into photography, for example, could be just what you need to get started with your news pastime, but drones are different. Is a very expensive drive, uh, then can even become a financial budget for you. If you are considered become a qualified pilot, you need to pay cost uh, for licensing. That is because more jurisdictions are now requiring drop pilot training and licensing. Typically, there is an NFT price registering your drone and one time test and payment. For become a certified pilot. Apart of for this, if you are using a drone, you will also need to buy a phone and or tablet to accept the uh, apps unless you buy a remote then become with a screen. You need also uh, to prepare extra battery for emergency if you are using the drone for a long time. Maintenance costs are also what you need to prepare in once if you are drone patients. You will also most likely need to replace part, have it re have it prepared, or purchase insurance to cover any damage. Next. So now, how drone works in business or industry? There are actually three industries will use drones. Include agriculture, photography, and construction. Now I will talk about agriculture. Farmers can make analytical data and assess the growth of crops easily. This helps farmers to easily detect the problems and solve it quickly before getting worse. Farmers also can observe the growth of crops easily using this technology. Furthermore, drones are used in spraying water or pesticides for large-scale farming to ensure the crops are grown in good conditions without drone farmers takes a long time to spray the water because the large area will make the farmer tired farmers feel tired under the sun now i will pass to yijun to continue the presentation uh, second uh, photography uh, when during travel uh, we can use drone uh, to take picture because uh, drone provide human with uh, bird eyes that can make human uh, so what a uh, bird saw on the sky. Uh, besides drama, uh, drone also can make drama can be more different angles and style. Uh, it's because drone uh, can make shots of the content can be more creative uh, being taken from angel that normal camera can reach. Some drones also have wide angel function uh, that can take a shot with wider angle, for example, fast and the furious. Drone uh, is used to take most of the action part because it is most stable compared to a person sitting inside a car uh, holding a camera to take the action shot. Next is the construction. Drone help to carry heavy building materials and send to a location. Uh, this because a drone can help to bring he heavy object near to the worker and drone can uh, 
capable to fly up the sky in a certain height. Uh, this can help people in charge of the site to observe and manage constructive more effectively because last car project needs some time to identify problem if using manpower. But because uh, but if use drone technology uh, can help reducing the construction cost. Next. Uh, conclusion. In this assignment, our presentation is about Tron. Uh, Tron also named is a man aircraft a man aircraft tool uh, that can be used as military weapon delivery machine camera and lp croucher use it brings a lot of change in our life thank you Juan no hidaya who is watching this video until the end we are from group three who are include Cheng Yujun, Li Zhenqiang, Xin Ka Chun, Su Wei Chong, and Wen Li Zhiyi. Please give a like, clap, and subscribe to our groups. We will be happy if teacher give us full marks. Thank you. That is our full presentation. <laughs>